from what we've heard before was that you know Buhari um has really gone to London for medical checkup, just medical checkup, which he has been doing. But I think that is not even the issue now. I uh, remember during the time during the time when this man was going to was not in the country, Tinubu himself was not in the country. We were told they went for medical treatment and they were giving updates of what he went there to do, but they were denying it. But at the end of the day, they couldn't even hide it anymore. So we thought uh, Buhari was going to London for his normal checkup, just like they always tell us. But this time around, it is a different thing altogether. All is now set for President Mohamed Buhari to undergo surgery for the removal of a mass in his body believed to be cancerous at Royal Brompton Hospital in the United Kingdom. Sahar reporters has gathered. Hey, why did he get all this information? Now, wow. The hospital is situated by Sydney Street, London, SW3 CISNP, that is the postcode. Meanwhile, sources said, even though the procedure will keep President Buhari away for at least two weeks, he refused to hand over to Vice President Yemi Oshibaju. Mass in medicine is a lump in the body. It may be caused by the abnormal growth of cells, a cyst, hormonal changes, or an immune reaction, also known as tumors. They can start in any one of the trillions of cells in our bodies. They grow and behave differently depending on whether they are cancerous, non-cancerous, or precancerous. When cancer cells form a lump or growth, it is called a cancerous tumor. A tumor is cancerous when it grows into nearby tissues or has cells that can break away and travel through the blood or lymphatic system and spread to lymph nodes and distant parts of the body. A presidential source on Monday told Sahara reporters that Buhari is expected to undergo a complicated surgical procedure in the UK hospital to take out the tumor and some of the healthy tissues near it. He said our principal president Buhari is to undergo a complicated surgical procedure in the uk meanwhile the procedure is more complicated than being reviewed by femi Adesino and other presidential is the presidential source said if it's a procedure to remove a mass inside his body believed to be cancerous and it should be done at royal brompton hospital it will be gone for two weeks but could stay longer he had earlier pushed the treatment to further notice but his doctors warned him to do it now or die Unfortunately, he refused to hand over to Vice President Oshiba Ju as usual. Sahar reporters had exclusively reported that Buhari, who recently traveled to Seoul, South Africa, on a five day official visit, would also be going to London, where he would be seeing his doctors. President Buhari is scheduled to depart Abuja for Seoul, South Africa, on a five day official visit to the Asian country, a source had said. The president who wanted to visit Doha, Qatar, last month but was snubbed by the Qatari leader is supposed to go on a merry go round around the world between now and his eagerly awaited exit from power in about seven months. From Seo Buhari, we proceed to London where he is scheduled to undergo a medical procedure at the Royal Brompton Hospital situated at Sydney. Streets London SW3 CISNP between November 1st and 2nd, 2022. Confirming the report on Monday, the special advisor of President Buhari on media and publicity, Femi Adeshino, on his Twitter account said the president would be going for a medical checkup in London and would be back in Nigeria in the second week of November. Adeshino said President Buhari leaves for London October 31st, 2022, for routine medical checkup. He returns to the country second week of November 2022. This is despite the rising tension and apprehension of the country, especially in Abuja, over the terror alert issued by the UK, US, Canada, Canadian commissions. Buhari trips comes a few months after Tamin bin Ahmad Al Dani, the Emir of the state of Qatar, declined a request by Nigerian president to visit the country. Okay, or oh, Al Thani. Holds the most powerful 
position in the country and has a prominent role in foreign relations. The Nigerian government had proposed September 11, 12, 2022 for Buhari to visit the country, but the Emir in a note verbal, verbal exclusively obtained by Sarah Reporter said the dates were not suitable for him and asked for other dates in 2023, next year. The Embassy of the State of Qatar in Abuja presents its compliments to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Oh. But uh, the mo most important thing now, the thing that we are hearing differently is say uh, this a uh, this a uh, major surgery. May God save our and protect him. May God bring him back safe and sound, but we must not repeat 2015 mistake by voting for Tinubu. Peter Obi is the best for the job. Well, safe journey and quick recovery. We pray for a good, young and healthier president come next year. Wish a quick recovery, Grandpa, you will be alive. This is better than the cover-up medical trip that we have been used to since the regime of course now the, the end is coming everything is coming to an end now so they want to be as transparent as anything so nobody's going to say leave or leave or leave or leave or that's it who is deceiving who? let's tell ourselves the truth he is the re he see the rebu harry hope he handed over to uh vp it's not up to 21 days now it's only when it's 21 days that that is when they can hand over according to their constitution they, are, they always read out hope he handed over to tinumbu or to <laughs> Oshibajo, please don't come back. Maybe Oshibajo may be able to do something about this insecurity. They want to renew his mask. The imposter is squandering taxpayers' money. He don't face other Nigerians escape from Abuja because of the insecurity based on US. Before he became president, he said PDP public officials going abroad for medicals are evils. Don't beg if you if you look at this man and just say that there is scam. Now better scam than be. He must be arrested and be detained till normal investigation is carried out. Yeah, okay, oh, this man don't finish our money. When will he thank Nigeria for a uh, for everything we have done for him and his family? Everything about Shiwore uh, our reporters is healing. <laughs> I wish uh, Mr. President a quick recovery. For the first, uh, for the past two, three years, he has not been sick. Why using the term alien president? They should not tell us anything funny because Nigerians already knew the truth. He is someone's father. In as much, I don't even like his pattern of governance. I wish him quick recovery. And they want to give us Tinubu as double wahala, as a replacement after Jibri from Sudan, alien Nigeria president. My people expect news like this that, okay, oh, blessed are those who are persecuted for righteousness sake. Mm. Which Buhari are these people talking about? Which Buhari are they talking about? Well, that is just what we are getting to know. I'm surprised that, uh, well, Femi Adeshino did not say that. They say a source from the, from the villa telling them this.